What's going on everyone? Today's video is made for two separate days of going out with my buddy Jason from JC Fishing and we were targeting big fish around bridge pilings using blue crabs as bait. So we got our blue crab that Jason was able to catch this morning and we are going to work with one crab. That's all we got. So you can really use each claw individually at its own bait. So that's two baits right there. We're gonna see, typically we just cut it in half and then use two. We're gonna see if we can quarter it and have four so we have six baits total and a quarter. So we got six baits right there. So I got my three. And I'm gonna go to my side. All right. And you holler if you look up. Same to you. All right, so the rig I'm using is a 5-0 trocar circle look right here. Big old beefy circle look. And a little little bead and a one ounce weight. It might be heavier than that. I don't know. This was like a, a bottom fishing rig I had from offshore, but this is exactly what I use. And this is 40 pound fluorocarbon leader. About three and a half foot section of that. Truth SG reel right here. The company now goes by Siegler reels, but this is an older model, so it's called a Truth and it puts out a lot of drag. I'm using my St. Croix Mojo Inshore 6'6 medium heavy rod. We're gonna be using a lot of drag to try and beast these fish out. I'm gonna take a quarter of the blue crab right there. Just wiggle the hook right into the shell. Just like that. I'm gonna drop it down in between these pilings with lockdown drag. Let's see what happens. You ready for this? Uh, I'm setting my preset, but yeah. Okay, here we go. When you set, like, when you hook one, you gotta pull them out. Yeah. Yeah, no, a drum would. Get it. Get him. You want me to go under and you can hand your rod over? Here. Here, let me get under and then you can hand your rod under. Got the rod. Yep. He's wrapped under there. But well, he's going. He's going. You want me to close it? You just you yeah, do it. He's wrapped. Get him. Beast him, beast him. Oh my. Yep. Let's go, dude. Dude, that's sick. Right down there. That's crazy. Let's go. Let's get another one. Watch out, I'm coming in. Got him. Yep, he's up. Oh you. you. That's not a bad one. Not a bad one. Oh gosh. Got him? Yep. Keep his head up. Hey, dude. Come on up. He popped. What? <laughs> we got a little bit of bait. Still got some bait left. Still got a little bit. They like the beer piece. They did. That did not take long. I literally see the fish tailing on that other piling over there. I'm gonna see if I can just drop the crab around front of his face. There he is. That is a big boy. He's going right for it. Oh my gosh, that was a big fish. There's a couple of them right here. What? How? Look at 
swim down there. I really want to see if I can sight fish one. There's one. me off I am a retie while I was retying I saw a drum come up right to the surface over here there's one there's one there's one that's a good one come on out he ate it on the jig. Come on. No. No. He's out. There we go. There he is. That's probably the one I saw when I was retying. Alright, we want to fight him out here. Turn. We gotta turn him. Get his head up. Come on. Come on up. Nope. Nope. Get him out. Get him out. No, 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 no. Oh man. Gotta be careful with him here. Gotta try and get him. No, oh, he broke me. No! Dang it. All right. So we tied again. Let's try not to break off. I'm gonna tighten my, my drag too. There's one, there's one. That's a big one. That is a beast. That is a beast. No! That was a freaking monster. I had to put so much heat on him. That thing was a monster. Oh my God. Big one. Loosen up on him a little bit since he's out. Away from the piling, don't want to pull the hook again. That's a good one. He ate the double claws. We were just like talking about moving. That's not a bad one. Keep the line going back over his body. Tire him out quickly. That's a thick boy. Come on over here. He's taking some drag. There he goes. That one's at least 25. 
probably closer to 30. Definitely not a, a puppy drum. Come on over here. The big old breeders that move in here. That's at least 10 pounds bigger than that. Yeah, it's just so tall. Okay, he's almost done. Yeah, he's almost done. Yeah, that's probably closer to 30. On the bail. And there's the first one of the day. He's got a remora on him. Oh yeah, look. Oh yeah, that's a good one right there. There is a remora. Look at the size of that boy. So that's probably about a 30 pound drum right there. Got him on the two claw combo instead of the half the crab. All I did was just drop it down right by my feet, right by the piling, and he just ate it immediately once I dropped it down. Pop that out. Show car worked today. It did. Right there. Oh, you hear Whoa. those drums? Literally a subwoofer. Holy crap. Boom, boom. You are drumming. All right. Jeez. One last look at this guy. Oh right God. there. And we'll get a release on him right here. Oh, that feels crazy on my hands. Oh. Hey there, big boy. Let's grab them by their tail. Let's revive them a little bit. They're pretty hardy fish, so he's already kicking. Give me a couple good ones. Go get your remora, buddy. You ready? There he goes. Oh, he took off. Dude, let's go. <laughs> I love this time of year.